So, <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. Okay guys, so I actually heard about this last night, but I was coming back from class and typically <sighs> news like this just doesn't shock me, but I guess, you know, it's just what's, 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 ugh. so Chloe gets cheated on by Tristan. Let me just get up because obviously it's like 3 a.m. in the morning and I'm shooting this and that's just how much I love you guys. <laughs> Plus, it's just some of the stuff is just so interesting to me and it's... Mm. Excuse my appearance. I, of course, you guys will see me in all types of condition. It's like 3 a.m. right now and I'm in bed vlogging about this it's just <laughs> I had to I just even I had to and it's you <laughs> well she got cheated on and to be honest you guys like I don't really feel bad for her it's weird like I don't feel like I feel like that's awful right like I feel like obviously like um no one deserves that. No one deserves to have to go through that, especially if they're, like, pregnant. However, like, the Kardashians have done so much, like, s like, they're so shady. They've done so much to other people that just sucks that it's, like, whatever. And, like, it's, like, how did you not see this coming? Like, the kid is young. He's a basketball player. You did the same thing. He actually, Tristan actually cheated on his ex prior to Chloe, with Chloe, while she, while his his ex was pregnant, and so now the same thing's happening to her, and she wants to act shocked about it. Like it's like, no, you know what, guys, you know what this reminds me of. You know what this reminds me of? This legit reminds me of Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie and um, Jennifer Aniston. Like, ugh. theirs actually shocked me because I did not think that they would go so many years before it finally happened. But it's like when it happens, it's like it's not a shock. Like, you know, you, you lose them how you get them most of the times. And it's like, okay, obviously this is a man that can't be faithful and if he can't even be faithful to his current girl what makes you think that you are the end-all be-all female that will like turn that over or something like that's crazy it always shocks me when women do this to themselves oh i look so and i'm struggling for light because it's like so dark and you guys know i'm a new youtube channel so i have nothing related to light or whatever but Hopefully I'll I'll get that for you guys and maybe. But I like vlogging. Like I like vlogging with you guys and just kind of like showing you guys core moments of myself. But but yeah, like it, that's what it reminds me of. It's like that that whole scandal. Like okay, and so they broke up and now everyone wants to act surprised or whatever, you know. And so I don't feel bad for her because I don't feel bad for Chloe because she's still rich. So wh why would I feel bad for her? She's fine or whatever. Like, I don't know. Like, that might be like an, an effed up thing to say. You guys let me know. But I feel like she's rich. Like, she, she literally has like no problems. And like, the Kardashians do this all the time to other women. So it's like, what's there to feel bad about? Like, she just needs to get over it. It just sucks because she's pregnant. But again, that's what she did to his ex. So it's like... Again, like again like what's there to feel bad about you know <laughs> you guys I heard this last night when I got back from class and I was like oh god I, like I just don't see what there is to feel bad about I'm sorry I just don't but like I like she's pregnant so it sucks that's that's what sucks about it but it would I mean the fact that she did it 
to someone else prior it's kind of like karma so you can't be shocked you know like you really can't be shocked you know it's you know just like when when like I said when Brad and Angelina divorced but she got a little bit further because they actually got married and it's not like they were planning this huge wedding and then it's like how do you not know what you're your partner is doing and and you're just sitting here planning weddings or whatever but you know you just it just it's, it's what happens especially when you keep picking guys that are like not in that same mindset you know and so i honestly feel like chloe just wanted a baby anyway and she's and she wanted that like family she did want the family but i think she just she wanted the baby more than anything and she got that i think it's hard to it i mean it's easy to sleep with a, a guy that's famous and has money but it kind of takes talent to actually get him to like uh give you a baby you know what i'm saying or maybe it doesn't take talent i don't i don't know but like it's like it takes smarts at the very least to get him to like leave you with a baby and um you know like black china did with with rob like i i love black china i don't know what people are talking about because i think she's just so smart in everything that she does within what she does it's not like like you know now that guy is paying like who knows how much and he's looking crazy out here in the streets or whatever like and it, you know so it's just do what do what you do um and if you're good at it you're good at it but um at least she got a baby and i think that's what she mainly wanted was a baby you know i don't really think i mean <laughs> you guys will tell me and she got a baby so it's kind of like well you got a baby out of the, the whole ordeal and and you're rich so it's like I get that you'll be sad for a little while but I feel like she'll be fine and there's nothing to really feel bad about I don't know if that that probably sounds insensitive I don't know you guys I'm sure will let me know but whatever you know I would have posted this last night but I was so tired and it's not really within my zone anyway but I do love vlogging and I keep up with this stuff because it is entertaining as hell you know to see other people's lives that are famous and uh, see what's going on it's just it's just entertaining like I, I it's fun for me it's fun to me to watch but um when i have time um otherwise like i'm working or in class and i just don't have the time but like yeah like you guys like i'm sure you guys let me know i don't feel bad for her she got what was coming to her but of course no one would wish that on anyone but i mean if it happens like you can't act brand new like you know like oh okay like no you know no like so anyways you guys that's how I feel about this whole thing it's just it makes no sense like people are just like freaking out for no reason but like yeah she just obviously she got che she got cheated on and whatever who knows anyways with famous people they do all type of stuff for attention anyway so th there's no telling but i don't feel bad for her that's my two cent like i see all these comments underneath the videos on youtube like oh poor coco like what the f what are you guys talk poor coco she's how much is she worth again like i can't even i can't even no i can't even with with some of those comments like coco will be fine so um coco as though i know her chloe whatever her name is like she'll be fine like um but yeah like guys that's just what i think but obviously like i, I will be vlogging on on certain things that come up and just kind of letting you guys know my thoughts or whatever but uh yeah i don't feel sorry for her not at all not at all uh i will catch you guys in the next video and thank you Bye bye